Hello everyone. Today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to download and install the Kaiser Redux mod for Hearts of Iron Core without the use or Steam Unlo uh, Steam Unlo <laughs> Steam Workshop and the Paradox Launcher. Okay, I'm gonna show you now why did I why I said Steam Unlocked. Uh, it's the site that I downloaded Hearts of Iron from. Steam Unlocked. Uh, you will get the latest version of the game from here uh, with all the DLCs also. So you go here, you click for, or you search for Hearts of, what is this? Hearts of Iron 4. This is the latest version currently and with all the DLCs included. You download it, and after you've downloaded it, you go to the files, you unzip the file, it will show a file like this, and the game is ready. Okay, after the game is ready, now uh, we will download the mod. I will put the link in the description for the mod, the mod link. I can't put this link in the description or else uh, I'll be flagged again. So, I'll put the link to the mod in the description, or you can just go to the top mods hoy 4 the site that I've done, I download all my mods from. Just search for Top Mods High 4 on Google and click the first link that shows. Okay, we go to search mods. Uh, today we will download Kaiser Redux. Okay, Kaiser Redux. This is the mod. We click on it. Then we go down, 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 until we reach this. We wait for the timer to finish. After the timer is finished, we click on download. It will take us, this is the link that I'll put in the description. It will take you directly here. So we go down, we click on generate link. We click download link. And then we click download again. I'll not click it this time because it will download the mod and I already have it. Once you download it, you go to downloads. It will show like this, a zipped folder. We just click extract all and we unzip the folder and another folder will show once it's uh, unzipped. This folder. We enter it. These are the, the mod files that we need to copy. So. We copy all of them and then we go to documents to Paradox Interactive. If you don't have this one, you need to start the game first because you downloaded the game uh, and you haven't started it yet. So you need to start it, then quit the game, then this file will show up. We enter it, we enter House of Power 4. Here you need two folders, mod folder and workshop. If you don't have them, don't worry, you won't have them. You need to create them. So. You create, first of all, you create the mod file, okay, you name it mod, you create a new file, name it mod, then create a new file and name it workshop. So, inside workshop, we also need new folders. First one is content, we create a new folder and we name it content. And inside, we create a new folder and we name it these numbers, 281990. Now, here, we need to paste the mod files that we just copied. Also, we need to paste them inside the mod folder here. We paste them here. Okay, so after the pasting is done, what we need to do now is go to Dowser. You don't know what Dowser is? No problem. We go to the game files. Uh, the game files I have are here in downloads because I just paste, I just unzipped the file and left the game files here. So. This is the game file for me, because I get it from Steam Unlock. I enter it, enter it again, then enter it again. <clears throat> okay, so here I go down until I see a file named Dowser. Here it is. This is the file. This is the equivalent of the Paradox Launcher. Okay, so uh, what we need to do is open up Dowser. May take some time, but it's okay. It's fine. 
Okay, so this is it. It's it's like the, the same as the paradox lander launcher, but it's not the official version. But it's okay and it's completely the same. So we click ignore. Okay, first of all, what we need to do is we press on this, the place it here, we press on it, and we click add new playset. Okay, we will name it to the mod that we downloaded today, which is Kaiser. Sorry, uh, read Kaiser read. Ducks. Yes, and we click create. Okay, now we need to add the mod that we've installed. When we pasted the files in mod and the workshop folders, uh, it will make the mods show up here. Okay, these are the mods that I've pasted in that file folders. So, uh, this is the mod we want, Kaiser Redux. We click here. Okay, and we click add to playset. Okay. The playset is ready. Now we go home and we select the playset which contains the mod that we want to play, which is Kaiser Redux here. Then we click play. We click play anyway, no problem. May take some time to load because my uh, my laptop is shitty. But uh, if you have a good laptop or good PC, whatever, it will load much faster. Now. It starts loading. Okay, so as you can see, the game has been loaded and everything is working fine. All is good.